this means to you. Southern, yeah! We got this up. I loved it. A lot this of is signs for you. A lot of signs. This is what we dripped of. This is how it's supposed to be. Yeah. I love the equality. We got Southern. We got JSU. Yeah, man. We got the Southern fans. We got JSU. I love yeah. it. This is a big day. Thank you all. Yeah, man. Yeah, Thank sure. you all for bringing it here, man. This 100%. is this is all right. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> how would you put in perspective what you faced when you came here? to get this program to this point, the vision that it took when you first initially got here? Well, it, it's, it's no way to get to the top without facing adversity. It's some mm -hmm. tremendous adversity. Oftentimes, adversity is inside the house as well as outside the house. But it's, it just takes a body of people who believe. Mm -hmm. And we believe. Everybody out here believes. The HBCU community believes. The city of Jackson believes. And we're thankful for this opportunity. Awesome. I'm glad you mentioned that believe because I spent time with you earlier this week and all around the facility, on the buses, you see, I believe. What does that moniker mean to you and your team? There's been, I had a mother who worked her butt off so ends would meet, and I was only embarrassed at her once in my life. I lied and told some of my homies that I played with that she was a nurse, mm -hmm. and they called her cleaning the hospital as a custodian. I made up my mind from then on that I would never lie, especially about my mother, yeah. but I had to believe. Right. The reason I lied, because there was a lack of belief in me that I could rescue her one day when she would never have to work another day of her life. Gotcha. So when I say I believe, it's not just about football. Mm -hmm. It's about the single mothers out there. When I say I believe, it's not just about the single mothers. It's the father that's in the hospital on dialysis. When I say I believe, yes, I'm talking about everybody who has the audacity to believe when they're facing adversity. Hell yeah. Coach, <laughs> this is my first time getting to meet you, and I've been a fan for a long time. Ever since you dropped the world with look good, feel good. Play good, play good. Play good, yeah. play good pay good, pay good, live good, live good, die good. Yeah. Everything you do, you're Thank good you. at. Okay? You're better than my friend who is the best at football. You're better than my friend who is the best at baseball. You make music that is absolute bangers. I want to come over there. Okay? You could be the top one preacher in the world if you wanted to be. Thank you, sir. On television, you're amazing. You're a content creator for Barstool. You literally could do anything in the world and be great at it, I believe, just from watching from afar, because I believe that you believe that you could do anything, and you should, because you're a damn legend. With that being said, why college football? You know, I was watching you kind of yeah. come out. You, TV, you were taking over. Content, you were taking over. A lot of money in both those things. And I would assume the prime, you know, the entire allure of prime is to look into that. Then you invested yourself in college football. Yeah. You invested yourself in Jackson. Why'd you do that? And what, did you know that this was going to happen this quick? First, I invested myself in the youth in Dallas, Texas, mm -hmm. an uh, organization called Truth. Then I invested myself in junior high, then high school, and it just kept going and going and going. I'm here for the people, man. I'm here for the shorties. I'm here for those kids that can't see their way up or see their way out. And I'm gonna show them. I'm gonna be their navigational system. And I love coaching. It's not one day that I don't wake up at 3.45 a.m. and say, I don't wanna do it. I can't wait to get into office. I can't wait. It's not even work. I can't wait to get into play and just have a good time with these young men and women. Thanks. Killing. Let's talk a little bit about this game. You got Southern coming in here this yeah, afternoon. They're good. They're game good. day is here. Yeah. Make sure this isn't a distraction. What's going to be your message to your team before they take the field today against Southern? We got to focus. We got to focus. We just cannot allow antagonists to interfere because we know who we are. We can't allow them to get us off course. Yep. And we got to be concise on what we do. If we do what we do, Ain't nobody could beat us doing what we do. We just got to continue to do what we do. 100%. I had one other big picture question for you because I've watched you coach. You know, obviously, we all watched you play. You started with Bobby Bowden before that high yes. school coaches. Who influenced you to the point where you, who, when you're out here coaching, Everybody. I'm just curious, like what names? What, who, Every, what, coach, what, coach Dave Cable from the Fort Myers Rebels that yeah. has passed away. Coach Bobby Bowden. Yeah. Mickey Andrews is yeah. Oh, yeah. me. Yeah. God, yeah. Mike yeah. Zimmer. It's, it's a collection it's cool. of Ray Rose. It's a collection yeah. of coaches that I set up to, under, right. that I, I, I engulfed in myself, yeah. and I see little bits and pieces of me. Yeah. But still, I got to give them that prime, too. Yeah. Okay, I got to give them this prime. That, yeah. That's the only reason I wore jewelry. They, got, they, they didn't come to see Dion. They came to see Coach Prime. Right. I got to give them that as well. Yeah, I hear you. And, and I, love, I do what I love, and I love what I do. This is a moment, man. This is a darn moment. <laughs> and, Ooh, and, baby. Because, and because of these moments like this, you know, I always say, if someone else doesn't want your coach sooner or later, you're not going to want him either. 
Yeah. There are plenty of people that uh -huh. want you. How will you handle any inquiries, any people from other schools coming in and saying, we want you to come? And how will you handle that, given what you've built here? First, I got to stay focused. And I got to maximize these moments and continue to dominate our moments. And when we cross that hurdle, we're going to cross that hurdle. I'd be a fool and a liar to tell you that I'm not going to entertain those things, because I am. But I have made, made no plans to move. I have made, made no plans to go anywhere. I have made plans to dominate today. So I, I have made plans on that. Yeah. Yeah. You know, we really wish that Lee Corso were here. Yeah. We probably know he's dealing with some health yes. issues. You know who you're tied with on the all-time interception list. Tallahassee. In Tallahassee. You're joking. Yeah. Are you Come, kidding me? I, I, I don't know that through the four You're parents. You're in the Sunshine yeah. Scooter. Are you You're in the kidding me? Yeah, man. Scooter. How about look that? Look at that. Oh, my God. <laughs> Two buck is up there at the top, and look at that. <laughs> yeah, but you know what? That, that means they, you know. Exactly. They, they didn't on. throw at me like that. <laughs> 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 Let's just get that straight. I knew that. Let's get that straight. I knew that was coming. Let's get that straight. They didn't try me on that. I knew that was coming. Hey, thank Fats. you so much, Fats. Fats. Well, can, can, can I end with this? Can I end with this? Yes, can. Who is swag, baby? Who is swag, baby? <laughs> Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.